Back to business. Prince Charles meets the Romanian president and prime minister during a visit to Bucharest after the excitement of Harry's wedding and his 70th birthday party. Prince Charles met the Romanian president today during a visit to Bucharest, just over a week after the excitement of the royal wedding and his 70th birthday party. The Prince of Wales, 69, shook hands with President Klaus Johannes at the Kotrasenai Presidential Palace. He later met Prime Minister Viorica Dancila in the capital, before traveling to Transylvania. Charles looked in high spirits as he arrived for his annual visit in Romania. Charles's first stop this morning was at the Kotrasenai Presidential Palace, before going to Victoria Palace for an official meeting with the Romanian Prime Minister. He goes to the country every year in order to recharge his batteries and promote skills and training in rural Transylvania. The royal owns two properties in the deep, sparsely populated countryside where bears and other wildlife roam wild. Three years ago, Charles set up the Prince of Wales Foundation Romania, which supports the Eastern European nation's heritage and rural life, and sustainable development. Next week, the prince, who first visited Romania in 1998, will attend a theater festival in the central city of Sibiu. Charles's arrival in Romania comes after a busy fortnight in which his youngest son Prince Harry tied a knot with Meghan at St. George's Chapel. That was followed by a 70th birthday celebration in the gardens of Buckingham Palace, ahead of Charles's actual birthday in November. At the garden party, which was Harry and Meghan's first public engagement as a married couple, the new Duke of Sussex thanked his father. Harry said, Pa. While I know that you've asked that today not be about you, you must forgive me if I don't listen to you, much like when I was younger. Instead, I ask everyone here to say a huge thank you to you, for your incredible work.